What's up, everybody? Chris and Mike here from Third Person Podcast. Yes, yes. we got a quick little video for you, and it's about yes. The Walking Dead, Fear the Walking Dead crossover. If you guys watched uh, The Talking Dead last night, they mm -hmm. reveal who the character is going to be. As you can see on the screen or in the title, or if you've already seen it, you know that it is indeed going to be Morgan. Yes, it is. Very shocking, right? Did you think that it was going to be Morgan? Nope. Thought it was Abraham. Yes, like everyone else. <laughs> I thought it was going to be Abraham too, and there was a lot of theory videos out there um, with everybody pleading their case on who they thought was going to be the crossover character. But that's not the biggest reason I think we made this video for you guys. Uh, it, I think from from talking um, the Talking Dead show when when Lenny James was on, he said some interesting uh, interesting words, and he said that he had said his goodbyes to the to the cast and the cast and the crew, and he made a Melissa big deal about McBride the crew. Was, yeah, was, was was seemed very upset, and it Melissa just McBride, gave right. uh, Melissa McBride. What did I say? Did I say something? No, no, I I talked over you. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah. So it just seemed very uh, finite. It seemed like. Um, Morgan's not going to last much longer on The Walking Dead. That's you don't what it really, seemed like. Yeah. Yeah. We both were, you know, Chris and I were texting each other back, like, yo, did you just watch Talking Dead? That seems very, you know, that seems very strange. So we decided to do a quick little vid. Um, we think Morgan's dying. He's yeah. definitely going to die. I don't know if it'll be uh, the midseason finale or if it'll be, um, you know, episode one, two of, uh, I mean, uh, nine, 10 or whatever of, of the, the second half. But, you know, we, we definitely think he's going. Do you have any kind of um, theory, Chris, or prediction of when you think we'll see him go? You think we'll see him at the midseason go? Or Well, they said he has a lot of, he has a lot of story left, a lot of episodes left. So it could be the end of the, the, end of the season. It could be. Yeah. It could be towards the end of the yeah. season, meaning that is going to be the end of the yeah. Morgan character. As we know, the Morgan character He's was, kinda was he was in the comic. He was a nut job, and <laughs> he died like straight away. Like he died like very early on. So mm -hmm. there's no precedent for him being in the in the finality of the final stages of All Out War. But oh, yeah. having him go back in time now, and you know, I my my question is are we gonna is it gonna be in between seasons you know one and three where we and saw three. him last and of course yeah. you know what i mean so so chances are the answers are yes and he's gonna um they're shooting it in texas right now i mean that obviously that's not they're still in i mean i think i think they're they're in new mexico still aren't they something. well regarding new mexico texas they're they're in that region so for, from from like you said because I do believe that it, it's definitely right after Rick left Morgan and Dwayne that somehow between then and, and the clear episode in season three, Morgan was gallivanting with the fear or, people. Or even between three and when we saw him on the train tracks. It could be that no, time. Because that whole time he was training and everything. Wasn't he training? After oh, he that? did go and train. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. So, so this is, hey. so this is going to be, so you think this is going to be pre- I think that, yeah, because they're 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 much pre Bostaff, yes, pre Kendo, oh, pre Kendo, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, absolutely, absolutely, Morgan? because he learned all that after Clear, after Rick, you know, left him. How do we know he didn't learn that and then he went to Texas? He could have done that, right? No, no, he didn't know any of that. He didn't learn. He didn't learn that stuff. He didn't know or have. Well, I'm those saying he could have learned it and then he gone and then went to Texas or whatever. The, or then went to Fear, basically. After he learned that, I guess we'll I guess we'll find out because <laughs> well, then we're hey, going to get a weird version of Morgan. We're going to get that broken, we're gonna, weird, yeah, maniacal maybe we'll version see, of of you know? of Morgan, which was not my favorite, to be honest with you. Yeah, you know, no, I think that's definitely going to be it. I mean, you uh, think so? it has to be. It has to be. He learned all the all his his bow staffing and everything. That was after Clear when Rick leaves him, and eventually he. You know, he, you know, that's what he, I'm saying, though. It'd be, but it'd be more interesting if after after he learned all that stuff is when he went on a walkabout, so to speak. But that, that's yeah. Then that would have to be some kind of a time jump or something going on in the fear timeline because they're they're substantially behind. You know, Rick and them now are at least, I'd say, what and, three years three or so. Years and they're only a year in. They're only about a year in, so there's there's a lot of time it's in not between. That long. I mean, the the time. And look, well, yeah. whatever the case. Anyway, well, it, you guys let us. You guys let us know what you think. Know. It, it it gives us a reason to to go to fear. 
They're they're not dumb. They're not dumb. And making it well, Morgan rather than Abraham is more interesting than Abraham anyway. Not to well, say that Abraham wasn't interesting, but yeah. making Morgan be the one that goes over there really kind of mixed it up a little bit in my book. And I think, I think you know they're they're doing it because they know that fears lo- fear is losing that, people that's probably, because it's yeah. So that's probably the main. So reason. let's get a character over there. Let's see. And they, hey, who's who's. Uh, expendable on on season eight right now or, or on the walking dead and that's going to well, be the morgan character because he's not alive in the comics he so. kind of reached his we said this many times like how many times are you going to flip flop and and with with morgan's character yeah. the good the bad you know um him him wigging out you know that's that goes for all all these flip flopping of the characters in the walking dead but especially especially morgan because i think i had said that a, a couple episodes that I think it's his time. I think it's. Uh, I think his, yeah. his time is up. So, yeah. hey, he gets another show. He gets um a little bit of extra he pay. Gets, I'm right. Sure. He gets to. He gets to continue <laughs> playing Morgan. And yeah. So, so I'm good, glad. Good. Yeah, for, we glad. like. We love seeing Lenny James. So. Yeah. I'll I'll all take right. all the Lenny James I can get. I don't know about you. Absolutely, but. absolutely. So you know, you guys let us know in the comments what you think. I mean, like me and Chris had said already, Morgan is definitely going to die. Uh, who knows when? Um, in season eight, the finale or not. Uh, but let us know in the comments. Of course, uh, Third Person Pod, catch us on YouTube, on Facebook, on Instagram, and of course on iTunes. You can sh- you can listen, have a listen to us uh, as well. But just get those comments in and let us know what you guys think. That's it. Guys, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Peace. Peace.